Right then guys, welcome back to another video and today I am reacting to Wes McDonald, Danny Guthrie and Matt Sadler signing for the Sadlers. Can we get 15 likes on this video, that would be amazing. So yeah, let's get on to my thoughts of the signing. So the first signing of the day was Wes McDonald signing for the Sadlers. Um, Wes is 22 years old, who is a winger and he signs on a short term deal like Jack Casey did earlier on in the transfer window but um, yeah he signed on a short term deal and um, Daryl Clark said he's, he's got something to prove here at the Saddlers um, hopefully he can do that um, a bit unsure what formation Daryl Clark will play but um, in the in the last two pre-season friendlies he's played 3-5-2 so yeah um, he looks like a decent player he spent last season at Yeovil um, I think he played 12 games um, so yeah, um, he's also played in the first teams of um, Solihull Moors, Nin Eaton and Birmingham City. So um, yeah, um, I'm pretty happy with this signing. Um, he's got potential to be a brilliant player, I've heard. Um, the first sign of the day, um, three signings in th um, three hours, which is brilliant for the Saddlers. Um, he was the ninth signing of the day, so... Um, leave a comment what you think of um, where signing for the Saddlers. Um, so yeah, let's go on, get on to the next signing. Second signing of the day was Danny Guthrie signing for the Saddlers. He's 32 years old, who is a centre midfielder. Um, he's got plenty of experience playing for clubs like Newcastle United and Reading. Um, he's made over 100 appearances in the Premier League. So like I said, he's got plenty of experience. But could he be the Dobson replacement? Um, obviously, there's been do um, rumours that Dobson is on his way to Sunderland. He's apparently set to sign for them, which I'd be absolutely gutted about. Um, he'd be a brilliant part of our um, team next year. Um, be vital to it, to be honest. Um, hopefully, we can keep hold of him, but he's set to sign for them. Also, Ferriers um, could be on his way out of Warsaw too. Um, he's got potential to be a brilliant striker, so... Hopefully we can hold on to him. But yeah, he said he's delighted to sign for the Saddlers. Um, he was on trial with us on Tuesday playing against Leamington. And he said the lad, the, the brilliant bunch of lads. So yeah, he's obviously got to know the lads as he's signed today. Our second signing of the day. But yeah, playing for Newcastle in the Premier League. Um, that's where he's most famous from. Um, looks like a decent um, midfielder. Um... Yeah, I think he'll do really good for us, to be honest. Um, in lead 2-2, two, two, got plenty of experience. Hopefully, he's not the Dobson replacement. We need to hold on to Dobson and Ferrier. But um, leave a comment what you think of Danny signing for the Saddlers. Is it a good signing or isn't, or isn't it? But yeah, let's get into the third and final signing. So the third and final signing of the day is Matt Sadler signing for Warsaw. Um, obviously, he returns to the club after... Um, playing in the 2011-12 season, making 52 appearances. Um, he's got a lot of experience, making 513 appearances so far in his career. Um, and he's played for clubs like Shrewsbury, Crawley and Birmingham City. Um, so yeah, um, he said he's really happy to be back at the Saddlers. Um, and, and he likes what Daryl Clark has said to him. Um, saying that he's got a desire to improve the team that's currently at Warsaw, which is brilliant to hear. Um, Matt is 34 years old, so like I said, got a lot of experience. Um, he's a he's he's a leader to um, at the back. So next season, I think it'll be Scar Clark and Sadler at the back, which will be a brilliant back three in League Two. But yeah, um, happy that Matt is back. Another experienced signing. Um, hopefully get a couple more through the door of them. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Um, free signings today. So um, leave a comment what you think of the signings. So yeah, um, up the Saddlers.